Hello everybody and welcome to the very first Brawl Stars Q&A. Unfortunately, I don't have any news for you. It definitely won't be three years in beta, but Android release is not coming or global release is not coming in the next update or in the very immediate future. Right now, we want to make the game as good as it can be. We want to make sure as a team, we feel like, okay, this is ready to go global. So our main focus right now is improving the core game and making sure that feels really, really good for a global launch. The 50 player band isn't a hard limit, we just kind of picked that to copy what other games had done. Right now, uh, we don't see any reason why the bands couldn't be bigger. So not ruling out 100 man bands. Or more. Or, or, more. or more. Wow, crazy. Oh. I think it needs a lot more it's for tough now. to say. I don't think that we're, when we're creating a new brawler, we're thinking this will be a tank. I think instead we're thinking like, what's missing? Is there something new we can bring that the other brawlers don't have? Right now, there aren't too many support characters. There's Poco, which has some heal ability, but other than him, there's really not too much out there. So that's kind of an, an element that's missing from the brawler selections. Absolutely, we want to implement band mail. We'd like to implement um, a lot more things in the band for leaders and co-leaders and stuff so that they can uh, really tell who's active in the band, how to add and remove members, and give a lot more tools for them to make the bands excellent. We're already working on mock-ups of the new game room and how we can make it a lot better. Um, another thing that's a little bit annoying in the game rooms is you have to scroll through each brawler. Yeah. We're hopefully going to make it so that you can also change your controls in the game room and uh, make it much easier to select your brawler. Uh, how do you feel about Bounty right now? So one of the complaints I see about Bounty a lot is that it can be very swingy. You can be mm -hmm. doing well a lot of the match and at the end the other team gets a lucky kill and suddenly it flips. So um, one thing we're going to do to address that is to have everyone start with two stars. And what this will do is kind of make it not as swingy and it'll allow a team to kind of advance all the way up and the other team won't be able to come back as quickly at the last minute. It would be cool if after dominating 90% of the contest, you actually were rewarded with the win. Like finding a way to bank your stars maybe somehow? Yeah. Like it would be a cool idea maybe if you could like run to your end zone. Okay. My, I protect some of my stars sure. and then I can go back into the battlefield or something. Yeah. That's definitely stuff we've talked about too. All right, so it's time to talk about what is upcoming in the game. The first thing we're gonna have is a new game mode. Woo! So this is gonna be different from all the other game modes. We're calling it, this is probably gonna change, but we're calling it Brawl Ball. Brawl Ball. Brawl, Brawl Ball. Ball, okay. So it's kinda like a soccer match. Um, and there will be a ball in the center and uh, it'll be 3v3 and you can go and pick up the ball and you have to walk it into the opponent's goal. Meanwhile, of course, the other team's gonna be trying to kill you. So if you try to fire when you have the ball, you're gonna kick or oh, pass. Okay. So, we have two new brawlers coming. Um, let's talk about the first one. So the first one is kind of a mystic character. Uh, she is gonna throw cards as her main attack, kind of like Gambit. Okay. Except, so she'll have a range somewhere around Shelly and the cards will be piercing. So similar to Nita's attack, they'll be able to go through so go brawlers. Through. Right. So will, what will the, will the spread be like Shelly as well? Like a kind of, or like a Poco type wider spread? It's uh, not Poco wide. Okay. I think it's a little slimmer than Shelly. Okay, interesting. But higher DPS, or like around the same DPS as Shelly? It's pretty close, but again, we're still tweaking this, okay. so we're not quite sure where the DPS will land. Very That's interesting. Cool. Tell us about the super for that character. So, the super's really cool. Again, we don't have a name for it yet, but it's going to act kind of like a black hole grenade. So you toss it, and anyone in the radius, any enemy in the radius, will get dragged Whoa. into the center. Brawler number two, again, we don't have a name yet. It's okay. Um, this is going to be kind of a Junker-like character. Her main attack is going to be, this is the fabled minigunner that you've heard. Ah, the minigunner's real. Yes, the minigunner okay. is real. And her attack is going to be kind of like a spread. So it'll shoot left to right 
across the screen. A little tankier in terms of health. Um, it's probably is gonna be more of a support character. And this will also be helpful in countering guys like Mortis, who can yeah. move around really quick, because with that spread, you're gonna get him. Now, what about the super for this character? Uh, what does it do? How is it gonna be useful? So she's gonna drop a sort of healing station. So what this means is it'll drop, similar to a turret, which means it can be destroyed by the other team. Okay. But anyone in the radius of that little healing station, your teammates will get healed up. Wow. That sounds OP. <laughs> yeah, I could see that being really useful. Like, hey, I'm just blasting everybody here. Meanwhile, I'll drop a healing station behind. Uh, anything else in the update that you can tell us about? So we're gonna do another change. This will be really nice for high level players. Um, the trophy cap is going to be removed. At the same time, we're not gonna have a trophy reset but we will have seasons. And so what's gonna happen is every couple weeks, you're gonna lose over 500. Every couple weeks, you're gonna lose a certain percentage of your trophies above 500. Is that, is that pretty much it for the next update? We'll have a few more quality of life improvements and other small changes coming, likely some balance changes too, but those are the big features you can get excited for. Well, I got